Canada invokes the Emergencies Act for the first time in 50 years. For the first time in 50 years, Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau used the Emergencies Act to calm trucker demonstrations over coronavirus regulations throughout the nation. Eleven persons were taken into custody earlier this week after a cache of weaponry was discovered obstructing a U.S. border crossing. Although Trudeau indicated the military will not be used at this time, AFP reported that police would be given more authority to arrest protesters and confiscate their vehicles in order to break blockades and prevent financing for the demonstrations. Thousands of anti-COVID-19 protesters gathered on Ottawa's Parliament Hill last month, obstructing traffic and demonstrating against vaccination mandates. Trudeau emphasized the need of exercising extreme caution when it comes to the deployment of soldiers on Canadian land, saying the federal government has received no such request. A request for help from the city of Ottawa or the province of Ontario would be considered, according to the city's chief of staff. A cross-country, freedom truck convoy against vaccination requirements and other restrictions had been organized with millions funded by organizers. Former U.S. President Donald Trump has endorsed it. A few opposition conservative legislators have been asked to apologize by Ottawa's mayor for complimenting the demonstrators and taking pictures with them. Protest trucks have been blocking highways and horns have been blaring in the city virtually non-stop, and a picture tweeted by one of the politicians shows several of them giving the thumbs up. Last Sunday, after being closed for over a week due to protests against COVID-19 restrictions, the busiest US-Canada border crossing reopened, according to the owner. More than two dozen individuals were peacefully detained, seven cars removed, and five confiscated along the bridge that connects Windsor, Ontario, and major Canadian automotive factories with Detroit, according to police in Windsor, Ontario.